All right, go ahead and tell me your name and where you're from. My name is Jonathan Finn, so I'm from Beckley, West Virginia. Okay. Uh, when you first think about homelessness or a homeless person, what image pops up in your head? Uh, poor, can't get a job, don't want a job, trying to live off welfare, trying to make ends meet, maybe for the family, maybe just, just being a bum, pretty much. What do they look like in your mind? Uh, unshaven, bad teeth, messed up hair, old clothes, buggy, pushing them out all around the city. What are you going to do to try to look homeless? Uh, I think I've got working so far. Um, I haven't showered for a day or two. I haven't shaved since like a week and a half. So, just old clothes, old uh, jackets, a blanket, and a toboggan. Have you had any experience with uh, homeless people before? Um, never. This will be the first time. Um, why are you participating in the challenge? Uh, for the experience, for the the value, the virtue that you get from it, I don't think you can get it any other way. You can go out and raise money for the homelessness, but that, if you do that, you're only you're only getting how to help them instead of you're getting firsthand experience if you do this. Um, what are you expecting to get from it? What are you expecting to learn from it? I'm expecting to learn a uh, different side of what they need, how we can help them now and in the future and if we ever, if I do have in the future experience someone with homelessness if someone in my family I can know I can relate to them I can empathize with them and seek help for them what are you most nervous about uh, how are the homeless people going to react once they see me if they see me how, how we can, the communication barrier that exists maybe with just just me not being on the streets and them living it as their life, how they're going to react to me as a college student, as an outsider, and so what Billy, they will, will be willing to accept and talk and vocalize. What are you most excited about? Uh, the return home. <laughs> Indeed. Um, no, I'm most excited about, uh, I guess, just getting the knowledge that comes with this experience. It's certainly a one, one, once in a lifetime thing. It's certainly something you just can't pass up. The value and the virtue that you get from doing this, it's incredible. It should be.